Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and this drawing lesson might be a little bit longer than some of the other ones, because I'm going into this completely blind. I have finally tried to, like, think of something that I've never drawn before, and the only thing I could think of is the purple guy with his knife. You know, I've never really drawn him before. Actually, I've never drawn him in my life. I've only drawn like the nightmare animatronics. Those are basically the only animatronics that I actually like drawing. But I draw them from drawing lessons online from cartooning for kids. It is the best drawing site ever. If you're watching this cartooning for kids, whoever the maker is, you are awesome. Okay, now let's get into the cr one of the crying children when he's still alive. Okay, so the first thing we're going to draw is his head. The head of the crying child. Draw the U, we're going to draw his hair. Kind of looks like a puppy. <laughs> Here, makes me look like a dog. And it draws freckles. I don't know if you guys can see his little freckles. You guys see his freckles? You just need to draw tiny little freckles. Tiny little freckles. Now we're going to draw his eyes. It's going to look absolutely terrified like... Like this. Like, uh. Okay, now we're going to go for this. Okay. To draw his arms. It's going to be like holding his arms together like this. Like, oh shoot. He's gonna have my channel logo on it. I don't know why, but I'm just gonna do that. Draw the little circles. It's like, kind of right, mini blocks. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I I honestly have no idea. But okay, now let's draw the really tall purple guy behind him. Since purple guy is like, he's I don't exactly believe that he's really human because he's like purple. Well, I mean he is human, but I don't really think that he is human, even though he is. Okay. Let's draw his fingers. Let's draw a big old knife. And the kid's just feeling I should have never gotten in here. It said free cake. <laughs> Trying to color that in a little. And the crying children are like five, so they have absolutely no idea what's going on. They just, they just saw the sign that said free cake, and they're like, woohoo, let's go in the back room. Then the purple guy just slaughters them with a knife. That is the story of the crying children. Legit. If you think I'm wrong, tell me what you think in the comments. He's gonna draw his night guard cap. I have a, um, I have a little game theory 
for FNAF. The um, I know exactly why the animatronics try to jump. Um, no. That's just my parents downstairs, but well, mom, stepdad, and my stepdad's friend are watching the KU game downstairs. But, um, if you kind of notice, well, you can't really notice, but here's my game theory. In all the FNAF animations, all the five FNAF, like, movies and stuff, the night guard is wearing a purple suit. And the crying children are what possessed the animatronics to, um, like, kill anything that wears purple. And so you know what happened. The purple guy is the phone guy. And, um, he made it sound like he was dying. And the last phone call... Oh jeez. <laughs> okay, well, um, yeah. The purple guy put his suit on the night guard. So, the animatronics are mad at the night guard because they think... The night guard is the purple guy. Okay, now let's draw his big hat. It's like boom. Let's have a big P on it. P. Bam! Booyah! Okay, now let's draw the purple guy's badge. They don't know that I'm recording. That's why they're so loud. And boom! That is how you draw the purple guy. I'm gonna add a few more details. Like, um, like, like a piece of a crown, like an arm. I'm going to draw, like, a little arm up in the corner right here. So, uh. Just an arm, then there's going to be a crying ch child right here. Yeah, that's basically it. This drawing lesson isn't at all longer than the other ones. But I also didn't do as good as I think I would. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.